Oh dearest, <laughs> I didn't realize this thing was on. Uh, hello. Um, let me start by introducing myself. I am Anne Moonigans, the bone specialist. <laughs> um, this is a uh, I kind of get hopefully they get through to you, Dr. Vanekat. <laughs> I heard a rumor from <laughs> special sources that you were hiring for your institute. <laughs> I just recently had to close down my clinic <laughs> because certain um, relatives to my subjects, patients, uh, uh, whatever you call them these days, <laughs> was um, um, not quite happy with the treatments I had to offer. <laughs> or is rather the treatments, there is only one. <laughs> you did say on your... Um, advertising video that you hired experts <laughs> in several different fields. <laughs> My expertise is in the skeletal structure and if this um, if I can be hired into your Lovely Institute. I will only need a few things and no real monetary payments since I have enough um, valuables to sustain me for a great number of years. <laughs> I have a few requests, though, of course, an examination chamber for my treatment to be done in. And, um, of course, I uh, maybe a small team of two um, helpers for uh, helping the patients that is assigned to me to leave the room after the treatment since uh, treatments can be rather <laughs> rough on the system of a human and um, will leave them uh, at times unable to leave the room on their own legs <laughs> or even to get off the floor. <laughs> um, I did hear though that those who applied would be um, offered uh, electroshock <laughs> therapy. Well, that particular thing I would uh, recommend you keep to maybe my patients uh, since, as I said, the treatment can be rather rough on them, even mentally, but it is at the end for their own good, you see. Several of the patients I've had before are people that 
uh, proved to have um, difficulties with their skeletons or are even unaware that they do have such structures inside their bodies. <laughs> and my uh, um, expertise, of course, they in the um, helping them control their um, treacherous bones, the treacherous skeletons, or simply to inform them in first uh, sessions that they, in fact, do have this extra <laughs> inside them. A notion that rather scares some of my patients. And of course, if they do not wish to have this extra um, consciousness creature, whatever, inside them, that is where my expertise comes into good use. <laughs> um, though it may lead, leave rather the patients rather um flat <laughs> after the treatments are ended i do have a further request it will not be in form of monetary payment as i said i would rather have if any payment is offered to be made in breadsticks <laughs> since I rather enjoy these small uh, this form of sustenance and it keeps me in training for the real uh, deal <laughs> so I, if you are interested in hiring me to your beautiful House of Hundred Hill Clinic Institute or Asylum, I uh, will come by one of these days to visit and see which patients of yours need my expertise. In the other fields, though, I am very much willing to learn, though my patient probably won't need medicine or uh, tranquilizers, since I have my own way of uh, making them calm down. <laughs> A strange form of hypnosis. I guess you could call it. So, <laughs> it would be exciting and very interesting to hear from you, Dr. Vanekot. I just hope your institute also hires what people would define as monsters. <laughs> Hear from you soon, I hope. <laughs> Goodbye.